Hello and welcome to EQ Magazine, India's oldest and largest solar media. Joining us today is Mr. Chetan Shah. He is chairman and managing director of Solex. Welcome, sir. Thank you. Sir, first of all, I would like to know about Solex. Will you please briefly explain? Uh, surely. Uh, Solex is an uh, uh, NAC listed company and uh, we are one of the oldest uh, uh, solar panel manufacturer in India. We started way back in 2007. Uh, Solex basically into the solar system since 25 years. So we are celebrating our silver jubilee in this business. Initially we were uh, into the solar heating system, water heating system and so on. And in 2007 we started a PV model manufacturing. And uh, Solex basically, you know, uh, we have a Pan India business where like we are very actively pa uh, participating in almost all tenders related to water pumps, street light, rooftop system on government buildings and other stuff. So we practically we are working in around 12 to 13 states in India right now. Now basically after uh, this COVID, uh, Solex has initiated the expansion plan for the model manufacturing because up till now we uh, our capacity was very small and whatever we produce we used it for our captive consumption for our own projects. So Solex, basically the challenge was to uh, make Solex as a model brand. So we took up this challenge and uh, we have uh, uh, started our factory. Fortunately, uh, this month itself, we have started our uh, first phase of production for uh, new technology machines. So basically this new facility in Surat uh, is of uh, uh, like by March, we will achieve two gigawatt. The facility is ready for two gigawatt. And by December 23, we will touch 4 gigawatt. So that's what is our expansion plan in modules. We have a plan for cell line also. So basically, we are considering that part as well. All right, all right, sir. Sir, with respect to pro your products, uh, what are you showcasing this year? Oh, well, uh, basically, you know, uh, globally, these days, the most popular products are uh, mono, uh, uh, mono perk cells, multi bus bar and uh, particularly with the M10 cells, which is 182 mm. So the power output is from 540 watt peak to 550 watt peak. So these are the standard 10 bus bar modules, which we are showcasing. Our facility is also ready for 12 bus bar, 210 mm cells also, where we can go up to 700 watt peak. Okay. So uh, that is our major thrust area for uh, this year with Monopark, uh, 182 mm and 210 mm. Uh, sir, coming to the technology, I would like to know about what technology you are using. Uh, see, uh, uh, as far as the technology is concerned, our uh, plant uh, is co compatible with uh, Monoperk, HJT and uh, Topcon, all three of the new upcoming technology also. So basically, we can produce uh, 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 modules with any technology. At present, since the Monoperk is very popular and HJT and Topcon is still like, you know, in a beginning phase so our major focus is on a monopark technology and uh, with monopark we have a uh, half cut and tri cut both all right, all right. so with respect to sir technology any plans for technology upgradation yes definitely we are considering as i said like we are expanding our capacity we just started and we are now we have taken up our expansion plan also so our new lines uh, will have a more capacity per line so basically we are going for very high speed, higher end uh, equipments now, you know, completely robotized. Okay. And uh, for technology also, we will be able to produce HJT and Topcon both on in upcoming lines. And uh, this production line will have consumer lesser space and higher production. Okay. So this will be one of its kind in the world. Okay. So thank you so much for joining us, sir, and sharing your valuable views about the company. Thank you. Thank you.